Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. I hope y'all are having a good divested Sunday. Listen, um, I know y'all are waiting for part two of the divestment versus swirling video that's coming. But in the meantime, I was watching a couple of videos today and I had an epiphany and I figured it's been a while since we had a little bit of a giggle on this channel. So why not have a little bit of a giggle, right? have a little bit of a giggle and also get a lesson of reiteration today on this blessed it Sunday and also the epiphany you know I want to share that with you so I'm over here minding my own business and this is the first video that I saw so shout out to Madam Kara subscribe to her channel if you need even more giggles because she knows how to drill she knows how to drag so definitely subscribe to her channel if you need more giggles in your life because you will definitely find them there. So I'm over here minding my own business and I see on my feed that Madam Kara has shared a video and like I was screaming. I was laughing so doggone hard. So this is the first video that I saw. I'm gonna go ahead and share that with you and then I'll share with y'all the other video that I saw when I was minding my business that drew me to my epiphany, which I'll share with you at the end. So go ahead and check this video out. Shout out to Madam Kara. This is where I got this footage from. Check this out and then we'll chat. Your baby mama put you out so you take back the bumper you bought her. All right, so y'all saw that and this is exactly why we are team back the blue in this corner because y'all saw that once zaddy's police department came to intervene in the circumstances you just saw that bitch ass behavior that they possess internally you saw how quickly he bitched out so i hope that y'all enjoy that clip this next clip comes from, um, I think his name is Donut Operator and he used to be a police officer. And so he has a channel geared towards um, breaking down police cams and things of that nature, particularly the ones that go viral, but he also has others that he comments on. And you know, he gives his opinion based off of somebody who used to be in the police force, right? And so I'm minding my own business and I see his video pop up on my timeline. So I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all all that footage and then we're gonna come back with my final thoughts as to what my epiphany is as it applies to you lovely ladies so check this out and then we'll chat okay now it's here tell me where to go guys right. just kick that last one more time there you go Around the fence. Yeah, he'll bite you, so watch it. Do you see him? Come here. Fuck, man. This goodest boy is tracking his little heart out, and wouldn't you know it, that little cockroach is hiding behind a washer and a dryer. This is a pretty dangerous situation right here because they can't see his hands and they know that he's armed and dangerous and he's already killed people and assaulted others with a firearm. Red don't care. Red just want to nom nom. Fucking Red. Fucking Red. Fucking Red. Fucking Red. Fucking Red. Get your hands up. Hands up. Let me see your hands. Fucking Red. Good boy, Red. Fucking. Fucking. Good boy, Fucking Red. Fucking. Good boy. Good boy. Get him out. Pull him out. Fucking Red. Good boy, buddy. Good boy, Red. Fucking. Watch that bad man, 
But that's a good dog, Red. That's a good boy, Red. You watch him, Red. Watch that bad guy, buddy. saw that and this was my epiphany right one thing is for sure hyenas are very afraid of dogs remember the hyena that had the little girl and a pit bull was about to go and attack them both and he left the little girl he climbed a car and then he left the little girl basically to get gobble gobbled by the little dog right so one thing for sure hyenas are very afraid of dogs so that leads me to my epiphany my epiphany is black women a dog and a pow pow goes a long ways in terms of protecting yourself if black women had a dog and a pow pow i feel like they would be a lot safer so that's the epiphany ladies having a dog especially like a dog like a german shepherd and getting armed will go a long way and keeping you safe and i love german shepherds and if this video showed anything is that german shepherds get it in when they're trying to be protective because one thing's for sure hyenas are very afraid of dogs and also if that caesar from black ink situation taught us anything is that dogs are way more valuable Sa. anyways that's all I had for y'all today. Like I said, the part two of the divesting versus swirling video is coming back. It's coming up soon. Just wanted to drop this gem for y'all real quick. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. I hope y'all have a little bit of a giggle. Let me know your thoughts below. Have a good rest of your weekend and a blessed divested work week. Love you ladies. See you in the next one.